we like to do jigsaw puzzles. Most holidays we have one up. Sometimes we keep one on our game table pretty constantly. We just like doing jigsaw puzzles. One of the last ones we did is this one. It's a picture of Disney characters. Well, we enjoyed doing that one. And I'm going to tell you something I've kind of learned looking at jigsaw puzzles. You know, people do them differently. Some people look for matching colors. If there's a piece of red on a piece already in the puzzle, you look for another piece that has red and see if it matches. Some people work by shapes. Okay, it looks like this one would have a U-shaped piece on it, so I look for all the U-shaped pieces till one fits. Other people look primarily for things. I'm gonna build the mini ears or the Mickey teeth or whatever it is, and they work by themes on it. But here's the thing I've noticed. If you work by colors or by shapes or by themes, you get the puzzle and the puzzle looks the same. You know, some people like to study the Bible by really extracting every verse. I'm gonna study every verse and figure out what it means. Other people like to do thematic studies. I want to find all the verses on a certain theme. Other people are incredibly motivated to study by the stories of scripture. But here's the thing, they all come out pretty much in the same place. I reject the notion that if you like to really study verse by verse, that you'll have a different truth from God than the person motivated by stories. Or if you're driven by stories, you'll come to a different truth than the person that studies thematically. I think all the things in scripture work together. I think God knew what he was doing. I think God knew people work different ways. And here's something else I've learned about jigsaw puzzles. <laughs> You know, straight pieces don't go in the middle. They go on the edge. And a place that has a U at the end of the plate, it doesn't fit in something that's got a square. Uh, the shape's got to fit. And you can all day long try to force a piece of the puzzle in the wrong place, and it never works. In fact, sometimes you'll put a piece in and say, it doesn't quite fit, but I'll make it. And you get kind of toward the end, and nothing's right, and you can't find the piece, and you realize you had it in the wrong place place. You know, I'm glad there are edges and I'm glad there's different shapes in the puzzle because they all have their place. And when you make a puzzle, it looks great when it is finished. But everything really does have its place. And it doesn't work to try to decide, I know better than the person that created this puzzle where everything ought to go. The edges are the edges and the other parts are the other parts. But when they come together, they fit beautifully and it makes a beautiful picture. We've got two or three jigsaw puzzles that we do often because we love the way they look when they're finished. But it only works when each piece is in its place. Kind of like the body of Christ. Boy, we make a beautiful church when we all fit our place. You know, God created us all with different talents and when God made you, he said, I want you to be part of my kingdom and I created you with certain gifts and certain talents, and you will be a valuable part of my kingdom. And of course, I just like the way that all those different shapes and all those different sizes and all those different colors make one whole beautiful picture. And I'm glad that in the kingdom of God, all races, all nationalities, all people of all economic status fit together to make a beautiful kingdom. So I love jigsaw puzzles because it teaches me a lot about the kingdom of God.